Mandibular nerve in the infratemporal fossa. The mandibular nerve starts a third division of the trigeminal nerve, which is the fifth cranial nerve. It passes through the foramen oval to enter the infratemporal fossa. It has two roots, large sensory and the small motor root. The two roots join each other to form the main trunk of the mandibular nerve. The nerve divides into small anterior division and the large posterior division. This is the mandibular nerve, third terminal of the trigeminal nerve, which is the fifth cranial nerve. And this is lingual branch and inferior alveolar branch. Uh, branches arises first from main trunk. Number one, nervous spinosis, enter the skull through the foramen spinosum. Nerve to the medial trigoid muscle, tensor palatai, and tensor tympani muscles. Then branches from the anterior division of the mandibular nerve. First, motor branches or motor fibers directed to temporalis muscle, masseter muscle, and the lateral trigoid muscle. Then sensory branch called the buccal nerve, which supply the skin and the mucous membrane related to the vaccinator muscle. But the vaccinator muscle itself is supplied from the facial nerve. Then branches from the posterior division of the mandibular nerve. Number one, auriculotemporal nerve. It is formed by two roots, which surround the middle meningeal artery. Then runs upward and deep to the neck of the mandible. Accompanied by superficial temporal artery and the retromandibular vein. It supplies the auricle of the ear, skin of the temple, and carries parasympathetic fibers and sensory fibers to the parotid gland. Then lingual nerve and the inferior alveolar nerve. This is the branches of the mandibular nerve. This is the lingual, inferior alveolar. This is the uh, auriculotemporal, these two roots surrounding the middle meningeal artery. This branch is called the corda tympani, comes from the facial nerve, comes to join the lingual nerve. And the lingual nerve arises as one of the two terminal branches of the posterior division of the mandibular nerve. It is joined by corda tympani at the infratemporal fossa. A descent just behind the third molar tooth to enter the submandibular region and the bus is superficial to hyoglossus muscle, where the submandibular parasympathetic ganglion is suspended in the lingual nerve. And the lingual nerve supplies the mucous membrane of anterior two thirds of the tongue and the floor of the mouth by general or ordinary sensations. And the lingual nerve is connected with corda tympani, which carries the following fibers. Taste fibers to the anterior two thirds of the tongue, parasympathetic fibers to the submandibular and the sublingual salivary glands. The inferior alveolar nerve appears at the lower border of lateral trigoid muscle behind the lingual nerve. It gives the nerve to myelohyoid muscle before entering the mandibular foramen and accompanied by inferior alveolar vessels inside the mandibular canal. Branches of the inferior alveolar nerve, nerve to myelohyoid to supply myelohyoid muscle and the anterior bill of the gastric muscle. Then branches to the lower teeth, then two terminal branches of the inferior alveolar nerve. Number one, mental branch, passes through the mental foramen of the mandible to supply the surrounding skin. The second branch is incisive branch to supply the lower incisors. This is the branches of the mandibular nerve. This is the lingual to the tongue, and this is inferior alveolar nerve passes in the mandibular canal and comes from the mental foramen of the mandible.